before installing Agent, make sure you have the supported version of Java Virtual Machine on your system. Double click the Introscope Agent Installer file to start the installation. The introduction page of CA Introscope Installer is displayed. Click Next to continue. Let's select the agent to install the Introscope Agent files and click Next. Specify the application's home directory that Introscope Agent will monitor and click Next. Next, select the application server to monitor. For the purpose of this demo, we will select JBoss. Click Next to continue. Specify the target installation directory for the agent and click Next. Next, you need to create an agent profile. For this demo, we need to create a new agent profile. Click the Create a new agent profile during this install option and click Next. Specify the required agent and process name. For this demo, we will specify agent as JBoss agent and process name as JBoss. Click Next to continue. Specify the host name and port of the Enterprise Manager for the agent to connect. Click Next to continue. Now, specify the required instrumentation level. Here, we will specify it as typical. Click Next to continue. Specify the Java executable location for the application server JVM. Click Next to continue. Specify the probe building method that will be used to instrument the application. For this demo, we will use JVM Auto Probe. Click Next to continue. Specify whether to enable Change Detector Agent extension during this installation and click Next. Here, you need to specify the additional monitoring options. For the purpose of this demo, we will skip any additional monitoring. Click Next to continue. Specify optional pickup folder for additional agent extension. Here, we are going to accept the default value and click Next to continue. Accept the end user license of BRTM. Click the I accept the terms of the license agreement option and click Next. Click Yes to deploy and configure the BRTM files, then click Next to continue. Review the agent settings and click Install to begin installation. Once the installation is complete, click Done to finish. Now, we will configure the agent to start along with the application it is monitoring. Navigate to the application startup script to add agent configuration to it. For JBoss application server, we will edit this batch file. Add the agent configuration into the file and save. Now, we will execute the run batch file, which will start the application server. For the purpose of this demo, now we will run the baseline scenario batch file to initiate traffic. Similarly, we will perform these configurations for other agents. Install the agents, configure the application server startup script to run the agents, start the application server, initiate traffic.